Hey guys, Mechanic CG here and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport. Today is episode number 22. If you guys do enjoy the video, make sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and let's get into the content. This video was streamed live on Twitch. Come watch us live with the link in the description. Alright, so we're going to be looking at the last of the amateur events. This is the uh, Viper versus Corvette. Um, first place gives us the Dodge Hennessy Viper. Pretty cool, pretty cool. I think that would have probably been one of the first of the few Hennessy cars that were ever made, so pretty nice. Um, starting off with Laguna Seca, Road Atlanta, Blue Mountain Raceway, Road America, and then Sunset Peninsula Speedway. So let's get going. All right, let's get going. We got the super fast Corvette now. Oh my gosh, the acceleration is unreal. Is that the Hennessy Viper behind? Is a hundred percent getting a bit too close for comfort. I really don't like this. I mean, we're starting to get into the really fast stuff now. And like some of these tracks are going to be a pain to drive around. Oh! Holy crap. Oh no, I've looked back and it's done that. <laughs> I don't like it. It's ridiculous. This thing's got so much power. But going through the corkscrew is the dangerous part. A hundred thousand million percent it is dangerous and my tv has just come up with a power off message which really bloody helps yeah no that car's catching up luckily The power off message is only on my vertical monitor, so I, it doesn't actually hinder too much. Just means I can't see my preview screen for my stream. Which then makes it a little more difficult to look at my chat, because I look at my chat, then look at my preview to continue playing before I move my eyes back. Multitasking at its finest, am I right? Just gotta hope the monitor doesn't turn off completely, because if it does, then that's gonna mess up with all of my stuff. Should be fine. We should be able to get this race done before the end of the timer. I got 220 seconds. Takes about a hundred per lap.
crazy. Whoa! Yeah, that's your own fault for uh, coming too far across. Definitely not mine for going wide and then having an unsafe return. But I also could not care. They're AI drivers, not real life drivers. I want to get my progression, so I'm going to do what it takes. And if it fucks you over in the way, then I don't care. Then I don't care. I don't give a shit. Boom. <laughs> Oh, shit. A little bit loose there. Bing! Bing, 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 bing. And there we go. 553. Not bad. The monitor didn't turn off. We're looking good. All right. Road Atlanta. Da -na 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 -na. Da -na 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 -na. Oh. This thing's bloody quick, by the way. And highly unstable at <laughs> the same time. It's quick and unstable. Which is pretty much every American car nowadays anyways. Oh my god, Creator's here. Slowly pushes a really heavy box that is quite large into chat. Runs away. <laughs> is that it? So you've pushed a box, it's now in my way, and you're just going to leave it there. The absolute disrespect. <laughs> uh, get back on. Oh, it's so unstable. Comes back into chat and places a box opener on top of the box. Runs away again. Ah, oh, great. So I assume I got to open the box and see what's inside. What's inside the box? <laughs> Creator. <laughs> yeah, what did you get, Blackout? What did you get? Oh, uh, this... This truck... I, d I don't mind Road Atlanta. It's, it's an alright track. But it's just so... Honestly, it, it's not designed for these fast cars at all. Well, I've opened the box. But, like, I can't... I don't know what it is. <laughs> An airbrush for model building and artwork. Ah, that's fairly cool. Blackout. That definitely help. That Hennessy Viper is actually trying really hard to get past. And I'm just like, nope. There's another box. Why is there another box? Alright, I opened the other box. What's inside the other box? <laughs> Don't say another box. I'm not playing these games. Oh, wow. The Hennessy Vipers just absolutely killed itself. Yo, Jacob. What's up? Welcome. How are you today? Hopefully, you're having a good day. Yeah, the Hennessy Vipers just ruined its race. That's good for us, though. Hello. I nearly ruined mine.
So, I... hang on. How do, how does that work? So the first box was just a normal box, and the second box became a portal into another room. Mm, logic. Hennessy Viper is really trying to catch up. But I'm not gonna let it. I gotta win this race and then I never have to look at the Corvettes again. I don't think I do anyways. You want Need for Speed Underground 2. Did you buy it digitally or disc version with a disc drive? I think I might end up buying a disc version of it to be honest. Well, yeah, on the PC, but did you get, like, a digital PC version or a disc version? <laughs> you could go into the room. You could throw someone into the room. You could have help investigate or do nothing at all. Right, I'm diving head first. Fuck it. Why not? <laughs> uh, 427. Not bad. Let's go. Did you fix your chair? <laughs> this is a funny story. Jacob, you ready? Non-existent. <laughs> I'm on a wooden chair. Trust me, it is just as uncomfortable as it looks. Which is very uncomfortable. I don't like it. But, uh, so I did, um, I it messaged the seller on Amazon. And the seller was like, oh, it's broken. Could you send photos? So I sent the photos over. Um... And they were like, okay, that is fine. We have the black one in stock. Would you like it? <laughs> the white one that I had before isn't in stock at the moment. So I would have had to have waited. So I just said, yeah, I'll take the black one. So hopefully, new chair coming soon. Always I'm wrong. Boop, boop, boop. Wanting you and people who look like you and move out of the way. I think though when the I, I'm pretty sure it is an Asian seller. Um. Because the time that they responded to my email was like 2 a.m. Which would have been like morning for them. And then the time when I responded, wood chair might snap. Well, yeah, obviously. This isn't a permanent solution. <laughs> um, yeah, and then when the second response came through, it was what? 11 o'clock, which would have been fairly late over there, and then no response since, which is a very weird time. If it was a definitely an English-based seller, I would have gotten a response all the way up until about 5 p.m., so, yeah. Keep wanting you and people who look like you, and why do I keep wanting you and... Oh my god. I'm actually surprised I'm doing okay on this so far. Never mind, I jinxed that. I can't tell whether this car is turbocharged because it it sounds turbocharged, the fact that it's going choo -choo, but it also sounds supercharged as well because it's got the supercharger wine. So maybe it's both. Maybe it's got supercharger and a turbocharger. It's also got the PSI dial as well. It's got like a pressure dial on the speedo. Which is like a telltale sign of Stuff, I guess. 
boom, 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 ba dum boom. Well, our goal for the end of the year is to get an average of 10 viewers. So, um, hopefully we can get that. Not bad. Very bad. Shit. Oh, this is not good. I need to get as close as I can so I can do a dive bomb on the inside. Like that. Oh. Just. That took a little bit too much ass clenching to get that corner pulled off. There we go. That's it. 6.22. Not bad. Uh, I'm going to save that replay. Because we haven't got any on Blue Mountains. Aye. Aye. Aye, aye, aye. Let's go. We've got another race to go. Yes. Another race to go. This is the one that I'm most worried about because I feel like the Viper could pass us and we might struggle to get back. Maybe we might not. Who knows? Ow. <laughs> not ideal. Okay, I was about to say, like, how has the dodge absolutely destroyed me there? And then I realized it's absolutely overshot the corner. So, I think what it's done is it's been stuck in my slipstream for a while and gained itself a good 20 kilometers faster. And then just gone past and started breaking and it's been too late. Oh my god. This is so quick. There you go. 
You can play GTA on a MacBook. Why would you ever want to put yourself through that pain? I think that's the fastest we've ever been. Over 300 kilometers an hour. Finally. Yeah, honestly, playing GTA on a MacBook is such a poor idea. Like... I'm sorry, but MacBooks... Anything gaming? Not ideal. Maybe if you're working on something, sure, but... Actual gaming? No. There we go. Bing, bing. Bing, bing. Bing, bing. Bing, bing. I've actually done a pretty decent job on this track. With this car, so... Ah, uh, not bad. Here we go. Right, 4.16. I saved that replay just in case as well. And uh, I think we've leveled up as well. Level 31. We've got Bridgestone, so tire upgrades are 25% off. Alright, attempt number two. Second attempt. We're gonna get this and get this done and dusted. I'm actually still a little bit gutted that we couldn't get um, Sega Rally to work on stream the other day. For some reason, it just completely froze up on us and completely killed my PC. Which is a shame, because I'm already, like, getting pretty far on with the game. See, that's how it's done. Storm in the pack. Not bad. Do, 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 do. There we go. Oh, that was the final lap. I didn't even realize it was the final lap. Okay, fun. That's us done with that. 22 grand. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da. We got the Dodge Hennessy Viper. 
Not bad. That thing's got a really high top speed, though. Crazy. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.